Choosing clean energy is top of mind these days from the largest corporations down to the individual homeowner. Over the past few years, the cost of a solar energy system has dropped dramatically to well below current utility rates, helping to give more American families and businesses access to affordable, clean energy. Once you find out that the energy to power your home comes from literally burning coal, you gotta ask yourself, there's gotta be a better way. Luckily, there is the sun. Starting day one with your solar system, you'll save money, produce clean energy, and even increase the value of your home. But the average homeowner has been put off by the panel's aesthetics. If you pay to have a beautiful roof, why ruin the look with panels that can be an eyesore? We found that people really like to customize their home. Up until now, though, solar panels have been stuck in the last century. Much like the 1915 Ford Model T, can get any color as long as it's black. Sistine Solar, born out of MIT, is changing that with their new product, Solar Skin. Solar panels meant to blend in. We're here on location in Hubbardston, Massachusetts at a cedar log home built by Katahdin, who has been committed to green and sustainable practices for over 40 years. The homeowner loves his beautiful log home and wanted to maintain its rustic appeal. Using Solar Skin, Sistine Solar designed custom solar panels as you can see here. We wanted to give the homeowner the choice to suit to their lifestyle, whether that is a log home with a green roof, a colonial with brown shingles, or a villa with clay tiles. Or even a picture of Elvis, that's what you want. With solar skin, the design possibilities are endless. Say goodbye to those ugly solar panels and say hello to a new era of solar, because you shouldn't have to sacrifice style for sustainability. To learn more about solar energy and when solar skin will become available, visit Design designspaces.tv where you can view this video again and find a link to Sistine Solar's website. You can visit these websites to learn more about the participants on this edition of Designing Spaces.